These are antimony goblets, famous for poisoning people who drink out of them. This is my uranium Fiesta Ware plates, highly radioactive, pound and a half or so uranium bar. This collection of elements led to an Ig Nobel Prize, but it actually all started with a mistake. This book referenced a periodic table made with real elements somewhere in London. Author Theodore Gray thought it was a real table. My name is Theodore Gray. Uh, in 1988, I co-founded Wolfram Research. I kind of accidentally got sidetracked and started working on a periodic table table, which is what you see here. He spent a whole summer just cutting and building the table part of it. And then he started collecting real elements to put inside the table. He started with some easy things like a pure bar of tungsten and then melted it down for this crazy crystal pattern. And of course, it would never be complete without some radioactive elements, which had tricky storage conditions. So that's all full of elements now, and that's full of elements. Actually, over here, there's drawers full of even more elements organized by atomic number. This is the business crystal that is on my poster and is the main picture in the book. Really nice titanium. This is a, it's called a blisk, a bladed impeller disc. So I can just open it. This is a chunk of rhenium. At various times in the past, this has been worth a fortune. My biggest piece of gold, so it's three and a half ounces, an ounce of platinum. So this is the coin, which is in the poster, 2300 years old. This is a really nice piece of niobium. And once the collection was complete, he had the urge to start getting high-res video of every element in his collection. That took years, even with the help of photographer Nick Mann. But once they had all of it, they had the first video of the periodic table. From a diamond that should last forever, to a silver coin that's been around for at least 2300 years. And my personal favorite is this bismuth crystal. So why am I telling you this? Well, I met Theodore Gray not too long ago, and he actually gave us licensing rights to make a full-size printed poster of his work. It's got these gorgeous photos on the front and all the nerdy details on the back. So if you want to have a reminder of all of the elements that make up our universe, just head over to our website so you can have the most beautiful periodic table ever created.